Hey guys, welcome to my channel, uh, All Things In, and a new Thursday and another vlog. Sorry if you see those dark circles, but I really can't help it. Even makeup can't hide it, and that's because I am not well. Even though I may not look like, cause I have makeup on. And now I don't really know if I should tell you right now. I mean, if I really need to discuss this right now in this vlog, or maybe I should just postpone it and tell you maybe some other day what exactly the is the case. But uh, I am not doing very well from past. Uh, many months and uh, the symptoms however became evident only lately but uh, it's basically that you know there's some bacterial serious bacterial infection in my stomach that has affected my intestine now and now my intestine is completely swollen and that's creating giving me a really rough time this story however I'm gonna take up later uh, in some different uh, uh, later in some talk session because I don't want to divert the attention of this vlog and today's vlog is about a place in Chhatrapur and the name of the cafe is Cafe Dori and uh, in association with Napa Dori and I don't think that requires any uh, introduction uh, and in case you are not aware of this Napa Dori is a very well known luxury brand which uh, delivers handcrafted uh, leather products so, so basically that's a store in Chhatrapur when I'm going now and in there they have a cafe and a library as well uh, so um, I'm gonna go there and check out how the place is I've never been there so it's my first time so I'm gonna go there and tell you my experience show you how the place is how the food is menu um, the price cost for two and uh, basically everything about the place and I don't know what's wrong with the camera it's zooming in and zooming out and making me look maybe funny or whatever so yeah and in the end uh, let you decide how the place is and if you'd like to visit it or not and then uh, yeah I'll give you my verdict in the end so yeah so guys I'm in Cafe Dori and uh, it's located in Chhatrapur. What's the exact address? Do you have any idea? Okay. So, okay, so I don't know the exact address of this place, but uh, Google Maps always come handy. And uh, my friend here is staring at me and making me feel conscious. But uh, yeah, so if you want the complete address, I'm gonna put it. Uh, in the blog and uh, that way it will be easier for you to search this place but uh, this place is really nice it winters are here basically in Delhi and uh, this place feels very warm and Christmassy already and I'll show you the ornaments and you're gonna love it so this is how the place looks like <clears throat> first thing you see when you enter is this beautiful humongous Christmas tree with reindeers and Wooden. She's not loud. I'm logging. Oh, I'm so I'm so sorry, guys. Uh, they the people over here are not allowing me to vlog, so I'm not able to record the place, uh, the audience. And uh, I just noticed that I have something stuck in my teeth. It's right here. But yep, uh, coming to the point, uh, they're not allowing me to vlog over here and make any video because they want to keep the, their audience very private and they don't, want, they don't want it to go to many people. So the moment I started recording, they just stopped me then and there. But uh, whatever little pictures and whatever little uh, piece of the audience I have and I managed to record, I'm going to share it to you and uh, then you decide. Uh, whether you like the place or not. So now let's have a look at the menu. I'm gonna show you uh, what the menu is like and what all things are there in the menu. Uh, yep, so. So this is the menu. This is the beverage menu. For all those coffee lovers. For all those coffee lovers, everything that you would expect. Friends.
French press, hot chocolate, cortado, cold beverages, iced tea, iced mocha, coffee top tonic, tea, chamomile tea, ginger tea, lemon tea. Then you have the food menu, breakfast options, a lot of it, quite healthy and organic too. The savory options. I'm giving a pause on each page. Uh, so that it's easier for pe you people to you know have a look at the menu and the dishes quite clearly with the prices uh, attached to it then you have quinoa and barley salad dori salad burrata and beetroot kale caesar salad sandwiches I've ordered this sandwich the first one creamy mushroom caramelized onion onion Rocket, whole grain, mustard, and brie. And then I've ordered the spaghetti and beet balls. Spaghetti and beet balls. So. Then my all time favorite section. Wherever I go, this is the first thing I look at in a menu. I think I'm gonna order. Coffee caramel panna cotta, or maybe, yep. I think I'm gonna go for coffee caramel panna cotta. It's vegan and it's gluten free, also. Yes, so this is there. Okay, one more attraction um, over here is that they have. Um, dog menu also and your pets are allowed if you're a pet lover and you want to come out on a date with your pet then you don't have to worry you have uh, you know space for your pets spell and a nice menu dedicated to dogs so for all those dog dog lovers and pet lovers um, Feel free to come here with your pet and uh, enjoy your time with your pet. Also, um, this place is really good for people who are diet conscious and follow a strict vegan and a gluten free diet because uh, not only in its ambience, this place is pretty wholesome and uh, uh, conscious when it comes to their menu. So for all those health and diet freaks, uh, come and check out this place you're gonna love it and uh, yeah so unfortunately they did not allow me to shoot inside uh, I could not log inside because uh, they have their rules set so they said you can't take any video here but the only thing you can do is just uh, So now I'm home and as usual tired and even more tired from my sickness but uh, yeah coming back to the uh, review of the place so the place was very good the omens was very nice and uh, when you enter the place you feel uh, like like it's Christmas already and uh, you see a really big humongous Christmas tree that, that gives you a nice warm cozy feel and um, everything there is a uh, woody textured if that makes any sense everything there is quite woody and you know you have wooden fibers all over the place basically on the furniture on the floor everywhere so that results in giving you a more cozy and warm vibe so if you are planning to if you want to go on a date with your partner or with your friend and want to have a one-to-one -one conversation so this place is a must visit uh, in that way also, uh, if Christmas is near, uh, Christmas is about to come very soon and if you can't think of any place, then Cafetori is the answer. Now coming to the food, the food is quite like 
the food is quite uh, like my choice so I don't have any complaints about the food there uh, it's quite European uh, the flavors the dishes everything and uh, seems pretty organic and uh, perfect for those who follow a strict diet plan in their life and uh, also people for, who follow a vegan or a gluten free diet this op uh, this place is a good option for you and um, everything that i ordered though i didn't order much because one i am trying to avoid fruit from outside um, no matter what wherever you go food from outside is fruit from outside and there's uh, nothing that matches home cooked simple meal like dal and chapati and that's what recommended to me at this point of time because uh, that's best for my health at this point of time but uh, whatever whatever i oh, and the number two is that uh, time when i entered the cafe it was neither lunch time nor it was supper time i entered the place around six o'clock in that time you know you you don't feel like eating much and therefore i didn't order too much but whatever i ordered i really enjoyed every bit of it and uh, that was more than sufficient for me so if you people want to try out european food and if you want that cozy nice wintry feel then cafe dori is a must visit try it out at least once guys you are not gonna regret going there for sure i vouch on it and uh, uh, if you've already visited this place, then do let me know in the comment section below. And if there's any specific thing that you want me to do or any specific place where you want me to be in Delhi, then do let me know that also in the comment section below. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Also, they did not allow me to vlog there when I started... Um, you know uh, recording the place, the omens, the surroundings. Uh, they just saw me immediately and and then they stopped me and I had to halt there but whatever little pictures or video or glimpses of the place I have and I could manage to take secretly I have done that I'm gonna share with you and then let you decide if you want to visit that place or if you liked it or not so yeah